everyone. Happy Friday. I'm so happy that it's Friday, you guys. This has felt like the longest week ever. So I'm super, super excited that the weekend is finally here. So I wanted to do a quick video on something I've been meaning to do a video about for a while now. And um, I just, things are so busy and hectic that I never got a chance to because it's not like your typical product review. But um, the thing that I wanted to review are these satin scrunchies that I purchased. I got them from a shop on Etsy. I had them custom made. Um, the name of the shop is Ileana Creations. And I'm also going to post a link to their page either somewhere around here or in the description box down below. But um, I wanted to get some satin scrunchies because they are like a crucial must have accessory in my regimen. I use satin scrunchies to pineapple my hair when I'm wearing a wash and go. Um, at night I use it you know to pine up on my hair I also use it to make buns which is like a fail safe style for me that I use um, quite a lot and I also use them to just like throw my hair up if I'm like cleaning or something to get it out of the way I love satin scrunchies because they are so soft and gentle in my hair they don't cause any breakage and I don't like to put a lot of tension on my um, hairline so they're perfect for that they hold my hair in place without a bunch of bobby pins and clips and everything I can literally put my hair up with just one accessory which is awesome so um, as you guys know scrunchies are not exactly in style shall we say um, like the sleeker hair accessories are in style and I get that I think they're very cute but for my very very thick hair I need something that's a little bit more um, substantial than like a goody ouchless band or something like that or like um, flimsy hair clips so I needed something that was really really sturdy that was gonna last from like a lot of usage a lot of stretching but was also gonna be like as gentle on my hair as possible so that's where satin scrunchies came in um, I looked for them high and low couldn't find them so I turned to Etsy which is great for so many random and useful things that you might need and um, I found a shop online. Actually, in my accessories video, one of my subscribers recommended this shop to me, which is awesome because um, I never would have thought to look there if it wasn't for her. So thank you if you're watching. Um, that video is so old that I can't remember her name right now, but um, I definitely told her in the video that I'll be checking them out, and I did. So with all of that being said, um, let me show you guys the scrunchies. So these are the ones, the two sizes that I got. I got a small one that's a little bit, um, the width is a little smaller and it's a little tighter. So this will be good for if I'm going to attempt doing like, like braid my hair in one big fat braid and I want to secure the end of it with this because it's smaller and the width is a lot tighter and not as voluminous as the bigger ones. It'll look better. Um, I can't imagine getting my hair all into one braid, but I think that look is so beautiful. Um, just one big braid in the back. I'm going to attempt it. I don't know how. I don't know when. But these will come in perfectly for it. Um, another thing that I use these smaller ones for is if I'm wearing my hair in a half up style. Like if I'm wearing it like, um, you know, just like half up, half down. I can use this to secure my up part. And it's a little bit um, smaller so my hair camouflages it. So it's not just like, hey, I'm wearing a flipping scrunchie. So, um... I use the smaller ones mostly for styles that I have in mind because I really can't fit a scrunchie this size around my entire, like fit my all my hair into this size um, if I'm doing a bun or like just one big ponytail and that's where the bigger scrunchie comes in. So this one's more so for styling. This one right here is also for styling. Um, it's perfect for buns. I actually wore my um, braids in a bun the past three days and I took them down today because today is wash day and um, I've worn my hair loose with a bun with this and I don't need any other pins I don't need any um, additional things to hold my hair up like literally I just put my hair in a bun with this and it's wonderful I don't get a headache from having my hair up and kind of like a little tighter than normal um, it doesn't feel tight actually because you know when you usually wear your hair in an updo it can feel like tight and pulling but with these the thing that I love so much about satin scrunchies is that they hold my hair up but it doesn't hurt I can literally go five, seven, whatever days with my hair up and it doesn't hurt. There's no tension, no pulling, no risk of breakage. So I love that. Um, one of the things that I really, really love about this Etsy store, um, and the owner's name is Mary. Her name is Mary, and she was very, very helpful throughout the whole process. She even sent me a sample scrunchie 
to um, judge if that was what I had in mind because she actually custom created these for me which is awesome. Um, on her site she had a bunch of traditional scrunchies, these bigger ones, but I knew that I had this smaller design in mind for the styles and stuff that I was just mentioning to you guys. And um, I couldn't find them anywhere so I asked her if it was possible for her to create it um, based on what I had in mind, like smaller and the width, the fabric width a little, little smaller than this which is a little bit more um, voluminous. And she actually sent me a sample scrunchie of um, to see if it was the correct width, elasticity, and basically it was what I was had what I had in mind. And I thought that was wonderful customer service that she did that so that I could actually see the finished product in my hand, make any adjustments that I needed to, and go from there. That was like amazing to me. I thought that was kudos, wonderful. So I knew then that I definitely wanted to work with her to make my scrunchies, and. Um, let me see. So this was perfect. So she made me seven of these and seven of these. So I should be good to go on scrunchies for a while. Um, so if you have like custom, you know, specifications, um, she's very, very open, very good communication, uh, very receptive. So if you decide to check out her site and you have something specific in mind, just message her and, um, you know, kind of go from there. I thought that was wonderful of her that she did a custom order based on what I needed because I like you guys I looked high and low for satin scrunchies and I was out of luck until I found this Etsy shop so um, I cannot remember prices at the moment because I did kind of like a bulk order so I cannot remember the prices but I want to say it was like I don't know I got like 14 scrunchies and with everything I think it came to be $34 and that's not bad at all for high quality product um, the seams are wonderful there's no like jagged edges like it's a great quality product I'm thoroughly thoroughly happy um, the craftsmanship is really really nice I think the elastic is very very stretchy so these are gonna last me for a very long time so I'm happy about that so um, if you're in the market for some satin scrunchies whether it's for pineappling or if you're looking to use them to um, make styles and stuff definitely check out this Etsy shop Mary was a really really great person to work with and um, I really appreciate her so yay definitely gonna be ordering more scrunchies from her when I need them um, so yeah oh and also you guys know that um, I'm guessing that most of you who watch my videos are natural and have textured hair but if not for my straight haired friends hello out there as well but um with scrunchies don't be scared they're gonna look like you just stepped out of 1992 because what I do is my hair is so curly that it usually blends in with the scrunchie a little bit or you know the scrunchies all like shiny and stuff like super duper on like e shiny or something so it doesn't like look like my hair or anything but it doesn't you're not just gonna see scrunchy so that's a good thing about it as well so I can kinda like move my hair around and cover up and hide the scrunchie and if I don't hide it it's not like looking really outdated and weird so definitely check that out um Tonight I'm actually be having a date with my hair. I'm gonna be having a hair date. I have not um, deep conditioned my hair since the day before Thanksgiving, so I'm long overdue. So I'm gonna be using a really nice deep conditioner and just like hanging out around the house tonight. Like it's a true date. We've got um, we got the red box going. We got brave, and we've got the campaign, which I got high um, recommendations from Lamont, my personal makeup artist. He recommended this so I'm very excited and I've been wanting to see Brave since like I'm a Disney movie fan so and she has curly hair yeah I've been wanting to see this forever so I'm really excited got my um my red my uh pink Moscato pink Moscato so after I drink this um probably won't be detangling until tomorrow because I'm sure it'll take me right on to sleep um I've got my caramel cheesecake ice cream and um, got my PF Changs. So I am ready for my hair date, you guys. But um, yeah, I hope everyone is doing well and um, is happy about the weekend arriving um, and that you guys have a great weekend. Also, don't forget, I do have my Bow Beam giveaway that's still open. It's open until Monday, December the 10th. So um, if you guys haven't entered, I will also post a link to that video down below as well so that you can enter. Um, before the deadline which is Monday at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so I will see